Hello everyone, greetings from PayTap's technical support team. In this series, we are going to learn everything you need to integrate PayTap's Laravel package into your Laravel project. Throughout the series, we will walk you through the 7 steps you need to fully understand and integrate the package. Now, let's move to step 6 of the integration manual, which is handling the post-payment responses or notification. In this article, we will learn how we can handle the payment response sent from PayTabs after the payment. But here, we are going to learn how we will handle this via the IPN response. The instant payment notification is the payment statue notification to the configured URL, and it's the pure server-to-server -server connection. That's what makes it more reliable than the return URL. It doesn't depend on the browser-based request, it's a server-to-server -server connection. So here, if you want to learn how you configured your IPN response, you have a solution article in our PayTap support portal with the name How to Configure Instant Payment Notification that you can check it out. And here, the next type we can use to handle the post-payment notification is via the callback URL response that we have clarified in step 3. So simply, if you clarify it inside your send URL here, a uh, callback URL, it will send after the payment the full transaction details. So here, we have used the SIMP webhook site we used in the return URL to receive this transaction. So as you can see, if here we have checked out and we have completed a complete payment, inside the request, we will receive the full content of the transaction. Now you can use this content and further code to use it as you can. Now please note a very important thing. Since it's a server to server call, so it's highly recommended to verify the return response then it will have a CSRF token. We have a full solution article over here to help you do that with the name how to verify the response received from PayTabs which is called the signature verification. And now, we are ready to go to the next step of the integration manual, which is managing the transactions.